The truth is, between me and them, nothing happened. Literally, nothing happened. And people ask us to comment on it all the time, and we don't, because there's nothing to comment on. And people just wanted a conspiracy so bad, and they're making these videos about on this night, this person snapchatted this, and this person tweeted this, so this must mean this, and she did this, and she tried to break them up, and she must have tried to bubble. Like, I hate that it had to turn into drama, and then no matter what the move was, like, if we didn't talk about each other, it was they're not talking about each other because something happened. But then if I mentioned David in like a, an interview or a podcast, casually, because I was asked about it, it was somehow taken out of context and twisted into like, I'm talking shit about David, and now I have to like, go online and be like, no, I'm not talking shit about David. I hung out with Curtis's friends. Curtis was there, this is what you told me. He pulled you to the side and he told you that. He told you, I'm so sorry I was mean to you, I can't believe what Jesse did to you, trying to get on your side. That, that part's true, but it happened in person. Even if you hate someone now, it's hang out with their rapist and his friends. So I was hurt and I told Gabby, Gabby, this is fucked up. She said, Jesse, Curtis's friends didn't rape you. What the fuck do I say to that? What's happening? Ah! Do I put this on my eyeballs? Yes. To oh, protect these are so her funny. beautiful eyes. <sighs> okay, wait, why? This is hilarious. And now. <laughs> is it weird that it's stressing I'm gonna me blow out? dry her face. Oh, sh. No, just it's kidding. It's a gun. Wait, it's a gun, on. it's a beauty gun. I don't like being blindfolded, you've got to Give me all your around. beauty. Like, let me get this straight. You say I have a big nose, I'm ugly, I'm a hypocrite, I steal all my content, I'm like all these horrible things. My voice is annoying. But I make a joke about your scandal and you hit me a. Do you remember that meme from a year ago when Gabby Hanna was singing Monster? That was a brilliant time for the community. What if I'm the monster that's been here all along? Today we'll be talking about Gobby. I mean Gabby Hanna. Gabby Hanna and her slightly messed up history. Before you ask me, why is she so messed up? Well, look for yourself. Please hit the subscribe button and join my journey to 1,000 subscribers. Can we hit it before Christmas? Yes, please. That's all I've got to say. Thank you very much. Gabby, the woman who could fit a whole microphone inside her mouth, and I don't mean sexually, I've put multiple things inside my mouth. And no, it's not Gabby Hanna's tongue. If you guys want to see me put things in my mouth, please go to TikTok.com. She released a song called Monster on October the 26th, 2018. It soon became a meme because it was so monstrous. We get it, Luke. You're trying to be so funny, but it's failing miserably. I was Detective Stevie for a day, and I went through her Twitter, and I came across a lot of old posts from 2010. I found one which actually says she hates animals. Do you want to see my little friend? No, I don't mean it like that. I meant my favourite pussy cat. Trust me, he can rip you to shreds. He, uh, scrammed me a couple times. We're going to read out her tweet from 2010. Keep getting emails from Peter. I hate animals though. If you don't know what Peter is, they rescue animals who are abandoned or abused. You've actually contradicted yourself, Miss Hannah. What's this inside your bra? And no, I don't mean your tits. I mean the super glider. Damn, it's so unfair. Animals seem to have more fun than humans. They also get away with a lot of things as well. Moving on, we're going to talk about our videos. Before you say, Luke, didn't you used to make cringy, awful five minute videos in the past? Yes. Yes, I did. But that was due to me not working hard at all. Here is an example of her wonderful creative videos. We've got the $1,000 facial. Is it worth it video? Damn, I thought facials would be free. Oh wait, which type of facials are we talking about now? Wait, is it the one that goes on your face? Ah, oh, no, I've been doing it wrong the entire time. We're supposed to be putting some sort of moisturizer on the skin, not... Oh, great. <laughs> Another example is Gabby Hanna crying, which ended up being another meme. Do you guys remember when Gabby Hanna's phone was smashed by rice gum? Because I do. Hey, rice gum! I just challenged you to a live battle on Snapchat. Would you do it? Let's, no. Live rap battle. Why wouldn't you do it? Let's, no, I don't want to. I'm standing out on the balcony so that it doesn't like make a scene. But, like, he literally, like, everybody's like, did he hit you? And I was like, yeah, he did. And my phone is broken, the screen is broken, the back camera is broken. So I need to get a new phone. Um, 
even if I was making up everything about him hitting me and twisting my arm, like all of that, even if that was all a lie, even if he didn't touch me, he damaged my property because of what? When I saw the video of Bryce smashing up her phone, I thought, Bryce, what the hell is wrong with you? But then I realised, it's Gabby Hanna. I'm pretty sure that she claimed that Rice Gum assaulted her as well. Which turned out to be absolute bullshit. That's why, boys and girls, you should never trust Gabby Hanna. I'm not the only one who's made a video on Gabby Hanna. There have been a few other YouTubers who have made videos on her. We've got Jessie Smiles. Yes, we mentioned her in the last video. We've got Anna Oop who's made a video on her. No, I sound like a visco girl. We've got, obviously, the well-known YouTuber Trisha Paytas making a video on her. We've got I'm Alex, we've got Pewds. Yes, we've got loads of other YouTubers and that is absolutely mental. Shows how many people actually like her in a community, it's absolutely crazy. She's made many interesting videos, let's give them a watch. The first one we're gonna watch is called Making Out of Shane Dawson. And this was three years ago. Now what did you get up to? I am pretty sure you guys have had some sexual interactions with each other. Don't make me laugh before we make out. Hi guys, welcome back. I'm back here with Shane. Oh my god, she's already touched me. <laughs> so, if you remember, I did a collab with Shane. We tried, what was it, German? I don't remember what the fuck we did. Wait, mate, I think you need to go to the clinic. I think Gabby might have a little monster growing inside of her. <laughs> something. I was so nervous being on your bed the whole time that I don't remember any of it. Well, everybody noticed in the comments that he was nervous to be in my bed because everybody lit up the comments with they should be together, shabby, I ship it, are they dating? And we decided that maybe we should try it. Now the world is officially over. And I'm not exaggerating here. The world is over. If they start dating, his relationship with Ryland is going to go down the drain. This video was published on the 1st of June 2016. Now we don't know the actual date that Ryland and Shane started dating, but I have a feeling Shane has cheated. Now this is crazy. Unless Ryland has given permission to Shane for kissing Gabby Hanna, we're going to move on to the part where Shane and Gabby kiss. Before you guys complain saying, Oh no, this is disgusting. <laughs> I don't care, right? YouTube has made it so much easier for me to target my audience towards people who are over 18. That's right. No, he's really emotional, creepy eye contact. Okay. No, no. <laughs> really, that's my favorite. You know that. You know that. Okay, okay. Yeah. I felt it. I felt it too. Okay. Round two? Round two. A little longer. Yes. That I'm felt like, good. I'm feeling some fucking... My tip. <laughs> Alright, are we going for it? We're going for it? Okay, no, we're okay. fine. Okay, ready? Okay. okay. <laughs> are you, you're gonna play like sexy music playing? under this, right? Okay, ready? Hmm. But yeah, other than that, I think her vids are absolutely brilliant and suitable for children. I'm not faking this in any sort of way, but YouTube's sending me a gift. And I'll show you on the screen right now. I don't know how this is happening, but this is crazy shit. Like, all I had to do was fill out my address and that was it. Thank you so much, YouTube. You've made me smile. So, uh, what should I do? Shout out to YouTube. Link in the description. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please hit that subscribe button. Turn your post notifications on. Otherwise, I'm sending Gabby Hanna to your house to make out with you. And you don't want that. Can we aim for 20 likes on this video? That would be awesome. Anyway, comment down below, let me know what you think about this video in general, if there's anything to improve. Yeah, you know what I mean. Luke's a shit YouTuber, that's a great example. Please add my Instagram, because I'm a very lonely person, and I need a girlfriend. All social media links are in the description down below, add them, check them out, that would be great. Anyway, peace out, stay awesome, have a great day, and I shall see you in the next video. Yeah.